Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we're getting into my skincare routine and the most important first step is cleansing. Today we're going to be cleansing with the St. Ives Acne Control Clear Skin Line. Just lathering it in my hands, fully saturating it into my face, making sure all the ingredients are properly absorbed and just rubbing it in. After I do that, I take my little pink exfoliating brush and make sure it's really set in there and it just helps to also exfoliate and cleanse at the same time and it's just really cool I got it on Amazon it probably didn't cost more than a couple cents maybe 50 cents yeah so then the next step is exfoliating exfoliating is really good to get any impurities and dirt out of your face I like to cleanse first if my skin is um, drier it was a little dry today so I cleansed and exfoliated but sometimes I reverse it and exfoliate then cleanse if my skin is oilier and it just helps keep my skin matte but my skin was a little uh, on the drier combo side today so that's what I did and these products are also really good for oily dry and combo skin and it's just the way you use them Next is our face mask. This is the Dead Sea Mud Mask. I bought it from Amazon. I'll link it in the description box below. Along with the other items, it is really good. It has the Dead Sea Mud in addition to tea tree oil, which is really good for acne prone skin, which mine is. I have hormonal acne and this is really good, especially um, around my cycle. I'm really prone to it, so it's really good to apply all over your face with your fingers i'm using just a foundation brush i got from the beauty supply store and i'm applying this and after i applying it i let it sit for about 20 to 25 minutes just so it can get really hardened and that way i know it's ready to um, be removed and i typically remove this with just a damp washcloth and some lukewarm water you don't want it to be too hot or cold The next step is derma planning. I do not derma plan every time I do my daily skincare routine, but it has been a couple months and it shouldn't have been months, but I decided to do it for this routine. This is really good to get that clear glass skin, really smooth skin type of look. What it does is you're taking this tiny painless razor and you are gliding it across your face. First, I applied aloe vera gel to give it some, um, to give my skin uh, just a little moisture and then I applied this retinol serum again I will link these products in the description box below I do not use oil because it is comedogenic and at, with acne prone skin it's not the best for my skin and if you have combo skin you know one little drop of oil you will break out and one day without moisturizing and your skin will get really dry so this is really good for combo skin so I'm just applying it now to my eyebrows as well because this is how I trim or you know define my eyebrows. I don't really like getting them waxed. I usually do this and I just take my time. I do have a smaller uh, Dermaplan razor that I use, but I, I was just using this so I thought to use it. Plus I've been doing this for a while. You just wanna take your time, do not rush, go in small sweeping motions and you'll be fine. The 
The next step is to apply toner. Again, I'm still using the St. Ives Clear Skin Acne Control Line. It's really good for combo skin, oily skin, even dry skin, which my skin was dry to combo that day. Um, but I'm just applying it, um, first putting it in a little cotton pad. Uh, first on the exfoliating side of the cotton pad, I got these from Target. I think they were like two something dollars. I'll again put in it in the description box below so you guys have all the products. Um, this whole skincare routine does not take me that long and it takes, it costs less than maybe 35 dollars with all the products mentioned which is really good because i don't pay 35 dollars a week i probably pay 35 dollars every couple of months for this and that's just when or based off of when these products uh, run out but yeah i'm just applying it to my face getting fully saturated and then putting my little fan on just to make sure it's properly absorbed and the next step is moisturization i think this is also the last step this is the last step as well uh, just moisturizing your face. I like to use my serum first. It has retinol, which is good for plumping your skin. Oh, I think it also has hyaluronic acid and peptides. Collagen, good for plumping your skin. So I like to rub that in, moisturize it. Now I'm using my Gua Sha uh, to really get my nice, defined cheekbones. And it's also good to drain your lymph nodes. So I brush it or I don't guess, stroke it. Sure, what you see me doing in the video, that's what I'm doing. First with the retinol, then with my moisturizer. It's summertime, so I need to have a product that's with or contains SPF. This product contains SPF. I don't have any issue with it. I, it doesn't cause me any breakouts or any, you know, kind of inflammation on my skin. Redness, it works perfectly. And I also have sensitive skin. So if it were to do something, it would have done it by now. But um, yeah, that's basically my skincare routine. And this is how I get clear, balanced glass skin. I recommend following this routine almost to a T, um, but modify it for your needs and purposes. I hope this video helped you. I hope you learned something or whatever. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. Um, and I hope to help you. All right, see you in the next video, guys.